tightened and changed my colors so let's go y'all I would say this is the most stressful part about having braces because the tightening hurts like heck but anyway let's go driving to the orthodontist this morning and y'all saw me arrive y'all it was so many people in the orthodontist i'm like oh my god it looked like the club on a friday night i'm like okay everybody in here trying to get their teeth fixed but anyway welcome back to my channel i am now some new members of the denny gang if you want to be a member of the gang 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 like comment subscribe hit that bell after you hit the bell put your fist up y'all gotta find me after you find me and you jumped in you're a lifetime member period period Period. 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 Nothing left to say like period. 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 Y'all, I just left the orthodontist and I have really, 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 really good news. My orthodontist was very, very, very happy with my progress. Y'all know I do not sleep on my rubber bands. So I'm super excited that this time around I did not have to wear rubber bands. And I only have power chains on my two top teeth. I did get a baby blue color. I got light blue. Y'all, I'm so freaking excited. So next time, I'm going to get a thicker wire. So basically, what they did this time was my teeth are doing very well. They're moving so good, and they're clean. So um, I don't have, I didn't have to get power chains on all my teeth. Only power chains I got were on my two front teeth, which is awesome. And then also, they switched my wire to a rectangular wire. I had like a round wire, so they switched my... Um, wires to like a rectangular wire or whatever and they obviously changed both my top and bottom wire and um, it's a thicker wire so I don't have to wear rubber bands and I'm super excited next time when I go though um, they're gonna do some different things as far as they're going to be installing a stainless steel um, wire the same thickness as this one they're gonna install a stainless steel wire and also um, I'm gonna get power chains again, but I might or I might not have to wear rubber bands next time. But anyway, I have had braces since February of last year and I'm super excited that they're doing so well. And I'm so excited I don't have to wear rubber bands. If you've ever had braces, you know the feeling like having to put them rubber bands on to sleep in before meals, after meals, like I'm lit. Like that was the best news I ever got. <laughs> So anyway, right now it is 8.03. I'm about to run to the gym. When I say run like lightning fast, give me a quick workout in. And then I'm going to go home and get ready for work. I'm also going to put my crock pot chili on. The crock pot white chicken chili. I'm going to make that today. So I'm going to put that on before I leave. And yeah, I'm just so super excited. But anyway, y'all, let me go ahead and get to this gym because it's 8.03. My appointment was supposed to be at 7.20, but it didn't start till 7.40, which made me like a little bit late. What I should have did was got up this morning and worked out and then um, came 
came home, showered, got ready for my appointment, and got dressed for work. That's what I should have did. But sis was sleeping. So let me go ahead and get to the gym, get my workout in, so I can get home and shower. And I will see you guys in the next clip. All right, gang. So before I head to work, I'm going to go ahead and put on my white chicken chili um, in the crock pot so that it can cook while I'm at work. And dinner will be ready when I get home. So, um... The ingredients, I pretty much already told y'all, but basically I just chopped up a whole onion. You're gonna need a can of black beans, a can of cannellini beans, a can of rotel, a can of corn, and then I have some extra stuff like some green chili enchilada sauce. Then I have taco seasoning, ranch seasoning, and chicken chili seasoning. Don't know which one I'm gonna use just yet. I'm about, I have tenders, so I'm just gonna use tenders. So I'm gonna clean these and put them in the pot. And then here are my beans. I just have them draining. So all you do is combine everything and let it cook for eight hours. And then towards the end, you add in your cream cheese. So I'll show you guys it whenever I get home. And then also I picked up these um, tri-color tortilla strips to put on top. And yeah. Lizzie. All right, gang, so it's the end of the night, and we're going to do a couple things, but I wanted to, before I end the vlog, but I wanted to come and show you guys. So earlier, y'all saw me putting all the components into the crock pot. So basically, y'all saw everything, and it was, it's been cooking for eight hours. When I got home from work, I took all the chicken out, and I just shredded it, and now you have white chicken chili. Once I put mine in a bowl and everything, I'll show you guys. It looking all good, but it smells really good. Um... I'm excited to eat it and then I got these tortilla strips to put on top and then you can put like jalapenos on top hot sauce guacamole sour cream whatever you like to eat basically on your tacos so I'll show y'all that and also y'all I've been telling y'all I wanted to create my coffee bar so I finally got these bottles in from Amazon I just cleaned them obviously but I got these um, bottles in from Amazon I want to say they're about 16 fluid ounces so I got four of them just so that I can kind of see they come with the pumps which I'm excited about because I told y'all that's how I want to measure out like you know how much syrup I'm putting in and then they also come with these little tags here that I'm gonna write um, what flavor is what and put it on the bottom and these are like the main syrups that I use. So I have more than four, obviously. The French toast is new. I tried it today, bomb. And then the seasonal syrup I have is salted caramel mocha. So I'm thinking I'll just put in my top syrups, which would be brown sugar cinnamon, hazelnut, caramel, and vanilla so i think i'm gonna put these four in these bottles and then just put these in the cabinet for like seasonal because i think these four i'll always like restock and rebuy so yeah i'm going to go ahead and fill these up with you guys make my dinner and show y'all and then we're gonna end the vlog so let's go ahead and fill these up
so this is kind of how they turned out i literally love how sleek they look so I, obviously i just cleaned them out y'all saw me filling them up and then at the bottom i just put the tag and what it is um i could have put it on the side but i kind of want to keep like that sleek some simplistic look so i just put caramel um vanilla hazelnut and brown sugar cinnamon so these are the four that i use the most so i think those are like really really cute and now i'm just gonna keep working on my little coffee nook but this is the first little step that gets me inspired so once it's all done i'll show y'all and then like i said my seasonal flavor is going to be the um jordan skinny syrup salted caramel mocha so i just put one of the pumps that was on the other ones on here and this will be one that i just grab occasionally like you know and i want a different taste or whatever but this is how they look if you guys want these of course i'll leave them linked below in the description box so that you guys can go buy them so now i'm about to make me a little bowl of chili i'll show y'all and then we're gonna end the vlog so let's get it So here is my white chicken chili. I just put some of those tortilla strips on top. I have a couple jalapenos over here and a little bit of cheese. As you guys can see, the um, tortilla strips are definitely keto friendly. It's only four carbs um, for a serving. So I just got me like a fingertip full and I'm super excited. It looks very, very good. So yeah, this is gonna be my dinner. And then I am also going to be drinking this clear frost white grape sparkling water that I got from Lidl. And to me, this one tastes like um, Sprite. So yeah, let me get a picture for Instagram and I'll be back. All right, gang. So yeah, I'm about to end the vlog. I just tried it when I say bomb chicken so tender so flavorful um the only difference i did and i'll leave all the ingredients and everything in the description box because i really want y'all to try these recipes i added a full pack of ranch seasoning and a full pack of white chili um white chicken chili seasoning as well so i think that that really you know elevated the taste but anyway i'm about to go ahead and eat i'll show you guys kind of what it looks like so in this bite i have like a little bit of everything and i really like this recipe because i don't see many people making like white chicken chili so um i'm glad i tried it but anyway i'm about to go ahead and eat um and i'll see you guys in tomorrow's video for day 27 y'all yeah because i'll see this on the 26th so tomorrow will be the 27th so see y'all tomorrow Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel a like chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced So no one else do what you do That's why I'm honest in my life with you I wanna please you anywhere I can I wanna share my world, don't you understand?